Sarah likes reading and hanging out with her family. But she's just discovered something else she really enjoys and she's really good at, coding. After attending some sessions of Code Camp during the holidays, I made the app using computer code. She already had the idea to do something about water safety after learning about it at school. I wanted to make an app to teach people about beach safety because in Australia, many tourists come to the beach in summer and the beaches are really crowded, so um, it will help people learn how to stay safe at the beach. And she quickly learned the skills to bring her ideas to life. It took me a day to make the app, but I also spent another day researching on water safety and sun safety, and I also spent that day doing sketches as well. The app is all about beach safety. It features three mini-games on different topics. The first one is about rips. Rips are strong currents of water flowing away from shore, and they can be really dangerous if you get caught in one. Sarah says the best advice is to avoid them, but if you do get caught, stay calm, float and put your hand up until help arrives. The Riptide Safety Minigame is a game where you start between the flags and you have to get to the other end without going outside. If you go outside the flags, then you go super fast because you're caught in a rip. The second is about sun safety and the different ways you can protect yourself from the sun. That includes using sunscreen, wearing protective clothing, a hat and sunglasses. Sun safety, it's where you have to go through obstacles and collect the sun safe objects before your sunscreen level runs out. It, you, it, you, it's okay to swim through the water if it has the red and yellow flags, but if you swim through the water with, the no, with no flags, then you have to restart. The last one is on CPR, or cardiopulmonary resuscitation, which is used when someone stopped breathing and their heart's not beating. The CPR minigame is a game where somebody is in trouble in the water and you have to pick the right item to save them. If you pick the wrong item, then you could get caught in the water too. Sarah says her app is really fun and she hopes people will learn a lot from it too. But for now, she's just excited to get started on her next one and have some fun at the beach this summer.